Fluffy. You're never nice to anybody. What are you doing? Huh? The confident expectation of divine blessing and the being given vision. Or are you getting ready to attack me? Which is <laughs> probably not good. Now there are sins against hope. We can, for example, become people of despair or a person. Of How do you know my stomach's hurting me? If I'm a person of despair, my what does that mean? cat's like massaging well, my stomach. I give up hope in the possibility my stomach's of hurting me. <laughs> You're such a good hard. fluffy. God seems to be too apt. Hmm. I've seen, seen cats do that to dogs, but I've never seen a cat do that to a human. It's pretty funny. I do not believe hmm. my sins will ever be forgiven. Fluffy, how come you ain't doing that down there? Man, a lot. Now, when we look at despair as a sin against hope, we have to be very, very aware of the whole range of psychological influences, which may mean... Possibly we're not in the realm of personal sin at all, giving into this despair. If you have despair on one side, you've got presumption on the other. 